For me, for me, Dakota, the film is unique because there is such a deep undercurrent to this story. I mean, we open with war. We open with a family that is torn apart and we have two dogs playing Dakota, Nikita and Ashley, and they're incredible. They're so switched on, they're so amazing, they're so alive, and they, together, they combine to create Dakota, this one character which really is the hero of our film. I think it's about family, and whatever family means to you. Uh, and I think it's about the uh, incredible bond between uh, mother and daughter. And I also think it's about friendship, and friendship in the most unlikely pairings. Okay, well my character's name is Alex Sanders and she is a fiery farm girl. She lives in Georgia and she's not scared to milk the cow and to take the eggs and the chickens, which I very much was. So she's very different from me but in ways we're very similar and she's very important in the story because she plays daughter and she's friends with the dog, so. Beautiful family drama, lots of textures, lots of layers, a lot of fun. I play Monty and uh, I'm the <coughs> grandfather. It's a hard one to say. I'm a grandfather for a first time, kids. It ain't easy. Sometimes family films can get a little bit over the top with the humor. So they kind of lose maybe their emotional bottom because you're playing for humor. Or you're, there's nothing wrong with it. You're playing for jokes. But this, uh, this walks a fine line in between the two, which is not easy because uh, you could get into cliche type characters if you're if you're doing that kind of that type of family movie but this has a real emotional bottom it's really held down by lola and tim and abby and uh and, and my character does his best to break that up i read the script very quickly uh, and i know if i read a script fast it's because it's good I couldn't put it down. I thought it was just beautiful. I thought it was a very beautiful, beautiful story. And I, I called him right away and I said, I love this story. And then he said, what do you think about the role of CJ? And I said, I'm yours. <laughs> I mean, I, I know that most animal-driven family movies are very forward in terms of that, but we really, um, I think in this movie, we've really embodied that spirit. Uh, the actors all get along so well. It's such a small cast and crew. You know, there is no smoke and mirrors. What you see in the movie is exactly what we experience shooting it, which I think is, is really special. <laughs> The two dogs and Dakota has been wonderful. They're both very different dogs. Nikita is the more active stunt dog, amazing. And then Ashley was more the, the hugging dog, the emotional one. Um, they both have been spectacular. You know, with Nikita and Ashley and Dakota, there there have been moments where I'm absolutely amazed at the work that they're doing. They're so they know what's happening. They they know they're on camera, they know the scene, they know the drill, and they're in the moment. You know, and so it's quite special to experience that with them. Yeah. Um, so 
so funny story about that. We actually, I had to come a couple days in advance so I could do dog training with the dogs. So I taught them a bunch of tricks like heel and the one where they go like on their, like they go like on their hind legs, like, and then there's um, sit down. But the one I like the most is when they give you their paw and you shake it, that one I love. <laughs> You know, people right now, especially with what's going on around the world, they're they're looking for uh, wholesome, you know, entertainment content, and they're looking to laugh. They're looking to escape from you know what's going on right now. Everybody's under. I don't think they want to go see, you know, horror movies right now or, or disturbing psychological thrillers. I think they're looking for comedies, and they're looking for wholesome family content. You know, I've done a couple of faith-based films before too. This is a great family film. I worked for the Hallmark Channel a few times. That kind of content is very, very popular in any time, in any era, any time, but particularly now. I think it's Dakota herself. She's just such a hero, such an unlikely hero. And the bond and the friendships between everybody is really special. And it's, you know, especially between Alex and Dakota. Uh, to see them grow from where they start to where they end up is really beautiful. The children's relationship is a lot of fun. You have me who's like the worst sheriff in the world and, and between Tim and Abby's character, you really have uh, compassion for each other in, in those relationships. And uh, I hate to say something for everybody, it's not that. Really, the movie's got a nice, a bottom soul to it. That uh, it's very loving in that respect, but, uh, but real, we're playing it for real. So for those reasons, I, I think it's special. Pessimistic when we first said, "Oh, shoot it in Italy," and and uh, but then we've come and really we're in Georgia, you know, and it's just wonderful. The, everybody, the crew is so passionate. They work so hard. Uh, they go the extra mile all the time. Great attitude. irvelino has been so kind to us, taking amazing care of us, and uh, I think it'll show off on the screen how how much people have worked. crew are so amazing and I'm so grateful and I love dogs I want a dog but <laughs> I really loved it and I can't wait to come back and I would name my dog I don't know there's so many good names Dakota's a nice name um, I named Dakota my dog after Dakota from the movie and then I changed my name to Alexander so then I'm really Alexander <laughs> <laughs>